Yes. Good morning, children. Today we will take new lesson, which is very interesting because after wearing that, we will be looking very smart, isn't it? And why we look very smart? That we will study about that. And you might have seen the different people who are in different states, their dressings and all. You might have seen. Okay. Then secondly, you might have seen the people who are working in the factories. What type of clothes do they wear? And why do they wear? Have you seen the doctors and nurses? They also wear the dress. Isn't it? What type of dress they wear? Why do they wear? Yes. We also wear clothes. Why do we wear clothes? Do you know that? Why do we wear clothes? Yes, everybody knows. Because to cover our body, we are wearing the clothes to cover our body. And, and one more point, because the dust, it protects from dust, heat and the insect bites. So, these are the three things main. That's why we are covering our body. It protects Clothes protects us from all the, this thing, hot sun, the rainy season and the insect bite also, these things. And one more thing that it gives the smartness also. We look very smart. In the functions also we wear the dress and different, for the different functions we will be wearing different types of clothes also. Dressing is also very different. We look very smart, isn't it? Then as usual, day, daily you are wearing in the house also, that clothes do you wear and go to the party? No, you will wear different clothes, which gives very, look very smart, isn't it? But overall that, are you wearing the same type of clothes in all the seasons? No, it depends. Season also. As per the season, Season changes, we also change the clothes. Isn't it? How many seasons are there in our country? There are three main seasons. One is summer, rainy and winter season. All the clothes we are changing it. These are the clothes we are changing. In the summer, what type of clothes do we wear? We wear light colored cotton clothes. And it will be little bit loose also. Why do we wear the loose, light colored cotton clothes? Because to air, let the air in and protect us from the heat. Because cotton clothes, no, it absorbs the sweat. That's why we wear cotton clothes. We give first preference to wear cotton clothes. And the winter, rainy season, do you wear the same type of clothes, cotton clothes and go in the rainy season? Rain? No, you will not. Why? Because once the cotton clothes get wet through, it will not dry soon and your body also will get wet through. That's why we are using raincoat carrying the umbrella. And what type of fiber it is used? That we will study later. But we are using, we wear uh, to protect from the rain, we are using it the leather coats, leather clothes we are using it. So that's why. And, uh, and uh, after that we will change and we'll, again we will wear the cotton or some other fibers, uh, fabrics, clothes, uh, dress. And in the winter season, what type of clothes do we wear? We will be wearing, we will be wearing woolen clothes. Isn't it? We will be wearing woolen clothes to keep our body warm. In the winter we feel very much cold, isn't it? So that's why uh, in the evening times and all, whenever you are going out, you will cover your body. And why do we wear woolen clothes in the winter? Why can't we wear this cotton or uh, plastic raincoats and all? No. In this season, we feel very cold. And the woolen clothes keeps our body warm. Let 
it will not let out our warmness body warmness outside that's why we use woolen clothes in the winter see depending upon the season and the place live in will be using the winter clothes now here lesson number 4 lesson number 4 clothes we wear this is the new lesson we have started today so please look at this i drew this picture of cotton dress t-shirts and shirts and dress materials different type of different material materials we use but cotton shirt knicker pantaloons and all will be wearing it even cotton saree also have you seen did you touch any time the cotton saree when your mother wears or when your sister wears that cotton clothes how it will be it will be very smooth and nice so why when we are you wearing this cotton shirts and all will be wearing in the summer season if you go to the cold places if you go to towards the north place where it will be uh, not much heat over there so which uh, not heat. if it is cold then what do we wear you will wear the little bit thick thick clothes which your body can keep you the warm which the clothes can keep you your body warmness that's why you will wear this cotton materials have you seen the military people army people what type of clothes do they wear it's a thick cotton cotton clothes they wear isn't it so that's what different no the types of clothes different clothes in different seasons i have told you so in the summer we will be wearing cotton clothes and in the winter woolen clothes and sometimes we will be wearing the uh, silk clothes also from where do we get the silk we get this uh, later i will tell you then in the rainy season okay leather leather also will be getting from the animals from the animals we get and this is the rainy seasons material raincoat also will be using it now different clothes in different seasons different people wear different types of clothes depending on the place they live in kashmir people they will wear the thick cotton clothes why because it's a cold cool states that's why in the south side you can see in the summer season they will be wearing just cotton clothes loose and all so this is the cotton from where do we get this cotton material in the cotton plant isn't it cotton clothes cotton cloth will be getting it from the cotton plants then woolen clothes from where do we get we get from the sheep woolen clothes we get it from the sheep and silk from where do we get we get silk from the silk worm and leather also we get it from the animals only from the leather what do we get we can make bags belts shoes these things etc these things we can make from the leather now umbrella is made up of what plastic or rubber umbrella is made up of nylon but the rain coat are made from plastic or rubber that is why if we wear the rain coat now what will happen or we inside our body and clothes will be dry only because the rain coat it will not absorb the water whenever the rain uh, falling on your body all the water will be drained away and you will keep your body dry so these are the things these are the natural materials natural things we get cotton from the cotton plant woolen from the sheep 
silk from the silkworm and the leather also from the animals so these are all natural fibers natural things we are getting it from it and we manufacture in the factory and we use it then okay now shall we read i'll show you in the textbook page number 178 lesson number 4 clothes we wear we wear clothes to cover our body clothes protect us from heat cold rain and wind and dust dust they also protect us from insects bites different people wear different types of clothes depending on the place they live in in the uh, the season and the work they do types of clothes we wear different clothes in different seasons we wear light colored cloth cotton clothes in summer cotton clothes keep us cool we get cotton from cotton plants cotton clothes made by spinning and weaving cotton woolen we wear woolen clothes in winter woolen clothes keep us warm woolen clothes are made of wool are made of wool we get wool from animals like sheep and camel these two uh, see the sweater and woolen balls isn't it so we also wear silk clothes in winter we get silk from silk worm can you see this this the silk frock then we also wear leather clothes in winter leather can be used to make things like things like jackets belts shoes bags wallets we get leather from animals like cows buffaloes and goats even the crocodile leather also will be used during the rainy season during the rainy season we wear rain coats or carry an umbrella rain coats are made from plastic or rubber we get rubber from the rubber plant so till here we have studied in our next video from where do we get all this material few more things thank you